Hey, what's up? It's SNT back at it again with another reaction spree. Today is going to be a quick fellow reaction by the one and only Lamley Group. Has been a while since I reacted to one of these videos here. This one we have here is the uh, rapid unboxing of the Hot Wheels 2020 K case. Can't wait to see what cars are to come for today. I thought I heard or saw something. Anyway, yeah, Hot Wheels has been going around for quite a while, but due to the pandemic, everything's kind of slow, but thankfully they kept going. I am kind of late for this video, but there was the next one is going to be a recent one and a long one indeed. So I can't wait to see what cars are going to be in the in the K case. And guys, if you have not already, check out Landley Group's uh, channel if you are a Hot Wheels fan. So let's just see what we have for the K case. Also, I wonder how Hot Wheels is doing with the manufacturers. I did look on the Hot Wheels website and there are some delightful new cars. So we're about to see what if we see them on here. So here we go. This is unboxing of the K case. Oh my gosh. Already the, mu uh, the music. Oh, it was 2020 K case. Thank goodness the thing did not start yet. Open white wheels. Pull Dude. I haven't even started yet. Okay, Porsche 911 GTRS Prelude Lamborghini Sesto Elemento, Velocita 60 Shelby GT500, and another Porsche Audi R5 S Coupe 98 Honda Prelude, another Lambo Humvee Night Dragon, and 20 G Gladiator. All right, Honda Civic Type R Acura NSX Velocita Croc Rod Plymouth Fury. Croc Rod, another Croc Rod, wow. Shelby, Nissan, Chevy. Honda uh, Civic, 49 Ford, custom, okay. Ah, beat all, what's up? Oh, two of them, sweet. I just saw this in uh, Peak Time Racing's videos. Motorsport, Lamborghini, Backcopter. Okay, okay, 450F. For Mustang ET, Lamborghini, and Jaguar. Okay, that's the first half of the box done. Now we have the second half. I see some pretty decent models in there. Let's see what we have. Manga Tuner, La Fasta, and the new Velociraptor. That's in the Street B series. Real nice. Alright, Electro Silhouette, Custom Auto, and another Custom Auto. I see Roger Darger for 2.0, Grand Cross. Two of them, those are new for 2020 as well. 69 Camaro and Range Rover Velar. Velociraptor, custom Cadillac Fleetwood and Erkenstein Rod. I see. Circle Tracker, Big Air Bel Air and Formula E Gen 2 car. Bone Shaker and 29, 2019 on the R8 Spider. Another one, 10 Toyota Tundra and two Tough. This be Dotson 620, Big Air Bel Air, and Manga Tuner. Pretty great cars. 60 Nova Wagon Gaster, Toyota 2000 TT, and 57 Plymouth Fury. Custom 1 Acura and Charger GSR, 69 Dodge Charger, and something like that. Dodge Charger, Wagon Gaster, 90. Hayes Benz Class. Alright, and then there's gonna be the favorites. This music. I wonder where. I really want to know where, uh, where, uh, Lamley Group gets this awesome music from. It's amazing. Anyways, this next video up we have. Opening the 2020 How We ID Mix 1. This is going to be a long one. Oh my goodness. Music's already kicking in. Ooh. I see. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, look at this. It's like the Volkswagen. Uh, that's a new Volkswagen truck uh, bus. It's amazing. Forgot that was, but I think it was supposed to be a Toyota. That looks like a super treasure hunt. How we have ID 2020 Mix 1. Gosh darn, that was an awesome intro. Okay. Looks like I haven't done a video in a while. Happy to be doing it. I've been doing a little bit of planning, using my time that way. But we are going Hot Wheels ID today. All right. And I'm very, very excited to show you what is the latest. Okay, it's a Nissan. I thought that was a Toyota. For the last couple of months, they're not going to hit retail until the fall. I 
was actually talking to the Hot Wheels ID team. Okay. There are two new mixes for 2020, the P case and the Q case. I have the P case models over here. I have the Q case models over here. Here. Oh, okay. We're gonna split it into two videos. We're going to take a look at these cars. I think it'll be really fun. But one little note for you guys, for you uh, okay. lately watchers. I've been talking to a lot of you about what you like from the channel and uh, produce videos versus live specifically. And a lot of you have said you like both. So if you remember, I have a second channel. The Lamley Extras channel is what it was called. Until I think I checked that out. Just changed the name. To the Lamley Live channel. Moving yes, forward, I've everything heard of that. Over on that channel will be live. There'll be live feeds on mail finds, store finds. Uh, just when I want to sit down and chat with you guys, if I have something new that maybe I just need to, like a new brand or something like that, get your feedback on, or if I just want to chat, we're going to get on the Lamley Live channel. If you haven't subscribed, go over to the Lamley Live channel and do that. Okay. Lamley, Lamley Extras, like I said. Sometimes the videos will be complete train wrecks. Other times they'll be really, really fun. But I think it's gonna we're gonna keep it loose, keep it fun over there. It's a chance for you guys to interact with me, for me to interact with you, especially get your opinions on things, and then we can reserve mostly uh, the produced videos and showcases and previews here for the Lamley YouTube channel. Um, lots of cool stuff coming to me. Okay. Sure. I might do the occasional live feed here, like unboxing videos. All and right. So on. But subscribe to both. You're obviously subscribed to this channel, but go. All right. Over. Can you just get to the unboxing? And Ooh, then we okay. Will, Twin uh, mill. Over to those models that are in the uh, police. QK's Paint of Twin Mill? Video. First one, Twin Mill. Now, we'll For get Hot Wheels Metro. Licensed cars first, because these aren't necessarily my cup of tea. I'm going to show them. That's we'll amazing. Get, we'll get done with these a little bit quicker. Um, but we're going to put the model first in the portal. Okay. Oh, Hot Wheels Originals, Twin Watch Mill. that go forth. I'm not going to make it too fancy. You can see it happening there on the iPad. And then, oh, that's amazing! That's now in the garage, and we can now look at the model on the turntable. This one is in a police livery. That's amazing. I don't know what else to say about it? Twin Mill's obviously a classic Hot Wheels casting. Mm hmm Um, and it makes sense for it to be in the Hot Wheels ID line, to be sure. But I don't know what else to tell you, so we're going to just leave it. But it's at a really that. great car. Next one. Roger, oh, Roger Dodger. Dodger. I think this is the second color of the Roger Dodger. Mm. There's the information here. Let's have a look at the model in, what are we looking at? Gold here. Gold. Um, let's get it in the portal into the garage as well. I think this is really kind of cool, isn't it? Where you just stick it in this portal and all of a sudden the car shows up on your app. Well, that's the magic of Hot Wheels garage. ID. Hit continue and let's have a look at it. Oh, on the wow. Table. So Spectre Flame yellow or gold, I don't know what you want to call it. Uh, Maybe Spectre Flame yellow. Flames. I like the chrome wheels. I'm really a fan of these wheels. I don't know what you guys think of them, but I think they're kind of cool. Yeah, so do uh, I. The way, they've, uh, the way they've styled them, and I like them. I like the fact that they're putting like the red lines, the blue lines. This one is in the chrome. Mm -hmm. it looks very, very cool. Next one. Night oh, Night Burner. Burner. I see. I guess we can see what line. This is the Night Burner series. Which okay. Makes perfect sense. It does. That thing looks great. Isn't this one like a whistle? It is a whistle. You don't, I don't necessarily have to show you what that looks like, but yeah. yeah. It's definitely a whistle. A whistle into the back. Let's put it in the garage. comes I don't have the volume on because I don't know how it would translate into the into the camera but there it is into the garage it goes and here it is and I don't know exactly what to tell you about it other than it looks it's really great Night burner how's that for an exciting description of a car let me put the box away okay all right, new casting alert. This is the Tankful. Oh, whoa. I'm assuming, yeah. I was, I was wondering about that model, so it's like what? A little bit different than the other truck. Then, but it's like a, a, yeah, Speed, speed Rigs. Rig, speed rigs. Like this is a new these, model. These new castings, I think, are that really looks cool. pretty great. That should belong in Hot Wheels Metro, actually. This one into the garage. Has the plastic rear metal front. That is awesome. So that's what Tankful looks like. I was wondering what this model would look like. At Real nice. Looks like a... Oh, well, we're about to see it up close. I'm trying to see if there's anything. It seems like there's things that kind of move here, but... Maybe 
it's just how it is. It's supposed to be a little bit loose. All right, here's the model on the turn. All right. Chrome looks cool. Oh, wow. Spectre Flame Red, which always looks cool. Modern take on a tanker truck, to be sure. Track compatible that way to kind of keep everything kind of in. I see. Dig in the wheels as well. Not licensed, but it is a new casting and definitely something. Uh, okay. In that color, I think is a, is a very, very cool model. All right. Okay. Now we're into the license. Second color of the Volkswagen okay. T1 GTR. Let's look at the first. That's color. also a new model. T1 GTR. I've never seen this one in Target. And it has the, uh, well, we'll do, we'll do it with the blue one. It has the removable top, too. So we'll get to oh, that really? in just a second. But this one, I think it does, right? I think it's removable. Um, so the first one came in that Zamac color. Next one is in blue, also from the uh, Speed Rigs series, just like the uh, tanker truck. I see. Get this guy in the this, all, this ID mix so first. far, it's really great. All right. Well, got to continue. Okay. continue. I forgot to do that. Now let's do this here. Hang on. Got to take it out. There we there go. go. T1 and GTR. Phil Reelman does the designs for Hot Wheels ID. He did the original drag bus. Oh, wow. Look this at that. still looks kind of raw. I guess I could call that a Spectre Flame Black. Right? They put the chrome rims on this one on the uh, on the actual image, but the model itself has the black rims, which I think look better. The blue top. I do like this one in this Spectre Flame Black with the uh, with the ghost flames, I guess you'd call it. That one very, looks very great. Cool original casting, to be sure. Well, this one's a new model. That looks awesome. All right. This also is another first sixty nine okay, Camaro. Camaro. So this would be technically a new casting, but based on a classic Hot Wheels Okay, it's casting. Factory Fresh. Factory Fresh series in green. All right. Now, this one's just classic. I love that they've just made it in a classic Camaro livery in green. I see. 427 Deco on the side. Mm-hmm. Chrome rims. Yeah, we'll do that before that. This is the way to do it, right? Mm -hmm. Look at it that way, and then I'll put this there on the camera and on the turntable you get the full premium treatment with these cars which i like so you've got the headlights you've got the tail lights obviously the side deco is cool the rims look awesome on this one mm -hmm. they're calling this one the copo camaro which yeah so there's the copo camaro casting so it's based on that one which was, I think was released in like 2008 2009 wow long ago huh that's just a cool car no matter what Nice to have a classic Camaro. I don't think they've even done the 67, right? For for Hot Wheels ID. I wonder if that's in the works. But this 69 is very, very cool. So I'll get it off the screen. Open up the garage. All right, three more to look at. Okay, and what I do we have cool here? Just to focus on the fact that these castings, with or without the technology, are really cool. Another one that's What is this? Nine... Acura NSX 2019. Mm. This thing... Uh, what, we've seen it in the um, premium now. We've got it in Hot Wheels ID. It was a super treasure hunt a couple of years ago. Okay. Hot Wheels Turbo Series. It's the first of four. I love this Spectre Flame Orange. Really? I guess let's put it in here first. Yeah, Acura 19SS. That looks really cool. What do we have for the paints? Take a look at the model itself. Nice and clean. Love the Spectre Flame orange. Mm -hmm. Black roof, headlights, taillights. It's a nice casting. As a matter of fact, I like this one better than the premium premium version only because I like the wheels better. They're be better balanced. The car looks cool. Honestly, to be perfectly honest, this may be the best version of this casting released. I know mean, oh, it's, it's first for Hot Wheels ID, but this may be the best. Yes. That this casting has looked. You guys can tell me what you think. And here's the cool thing. If I put it up close, notice they're kind of moving away from the total upslope chin. So I don't know how this will be compatible on the track. I oh my care. goodness. Now my blood is frying out there. But anyway. I'd rather have that. I understand. I don't why see what he's talking so about. Cool with it, but if they're not gonna. Well, maybe they're gonna move away from it. They had told me that they were gonna do some cars without it. Um, and maybe the 
maybe that's what we're going to see. I think the uh, from the next video, what is it? The uh, yeah, the McLaren Senna. And I'll do this one in the next video. It def it looks like it doesn't have the slope upslope trim. Oh snap! Well, so, all right, two more. Oh, we have here. Lamborghini, Lamborghini Miura SV. Second color, first color I loved. In gold with chrome rims. Oh, that's your first one? Really, really digging that one. And so now we have our second color. What is the series? It's from Factory Fresh. Okay. This one says one is four, two. Then what does that come from? Oh, I think it's just one of four in the series. Okay. Oh. Yeah, so the Camaro is two of four. That makes sense. I don't know if I looked at that correctly. Okay. And the Lamborghini, also green, is one of four. So that makes... I don't think it says what the other models are. I guess we'll have to find out. Okay. What the car looks like. Oh, that mm. looks cool and green. Get that in the garage. Yeah. And we're getting Mura. Ow. Gold or green? You guys tell me which one you like. I really like the green too. I like green it's too as well. Awesome color. Yellow on the tires, which looks awesome. Obviously, the trim. That in the really back, does look. Or the uh, deco in the back, deco Amazing. in the front, full graphics. I probably would have gone with the same size wheels on both, but um, for a Hot Wheels track car, I think this one's pretty cool. Okay. And but uh, that Matchbox has theirs, which is nice, and I can put those two together. I like that one. But yeah, All green's right, better more. than gold. And I think that's the this last car nice right there. Mix. Obviously, I don't really the the non-licensed stuff doesn't get me that excited. I think the next mix even a little bit better. But um, okay, well, what do we have for the last car? Definitely happy with this one. Oh, it's Nissan. Nissan GTR. Yeah. This one's getting all kinds of attention too. Is it gone? I think that's Hot Wheels Turbo right there, right? Yeah. Sure, you wouldn't have that chin okay, on it. I think that's the old version with the white. Probably won't pop as much that Let's see. slope chin on the blue. Oh, wow, this is a cool color. Oh, it goes like navy blue. Put it in there. Let's compare it. I've got the super treasure in my display. Okay. It's very similar colors. Very Super similar. Treasure. Oh, that's the Super they Treasure Hunt. really are the same color, aren't they? So definitely not in the anniversary deco that the Super Treasure Hunt has. Okay. But anyway, let's get it back in the garage. You guys tell me what you think about... I What I like, I don't... I rarely use this as a race. Um, I don't race the cars very often. But I do like the fact that this turns into a checklist. You mm -hmm. can trade the cars and everything else. That's why I would like to see everything get a chip in it because... Think about it, just the instant way you could organize your collection. You know, obviously the older cars would be hard to do that with, but um, even in one ways if you could do pictures and then put them in there. I don't know, all kinds of ideas. All right, let's take a look at the car itself. Looking good in the Spectre Flame Blue. Love the uh, red line tires, black rims, of course. Full trim in the front, full trim in the back. This one does, you know, yeah. mm -hmm. you go. That is the... I'd be curious to That's know. it. We will move on. Yeah, we got good ones. So we'll get to that mix in the next video. You guys. All right. Well, that was awesome, guys. If you have not already, check out the Landley Group's channel. Makes the best unboxing and stuff, especially with the Hot Wheels ID. I never knew we will do ID. I hope what other future cases for the Hot Wheels and Hot Wheels ID will come. And I can't wait to see. Yeah, what new cars are going to be in those mixes? Can't wait. They cannot wait. And also, I can't wait to see what Unboxing's Landly Group is going to do. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching and see you in the next reaction. So, if you go Thunder Reactor, uh, Reactor signing out. Reactor out. Yellow?